Hi students, uh, welcome to AJ Next. So we have Mr. Meet Burecha with us. He secured 24th rank in November 2017 exams. He is also a 42nd ranker in November 2014 exams. So Meet, welcome. Congratulations. Thank you sir. Okay, you have done a brilliant job. So tell me, since 17th I guess your result had come out, yes? Yes. So from that time, how has been your life? Life has been very different. I mean like, look, uh, Looking at my parents' faces was, it brought me more joy compared to the rank, to be very honest. I mean, the people all around me are so happy, like, it's just the feeling, it's, you can't just describe it in words. It's something which you can't describe. So now I think you have been there with us for the last three and a half years now. Yes. Four years across. Four years. Four years. So now you'll miss us, right? Obviously. <laughs> in IPCC, you all used to be sitting for eight hours, nine hours. Yes. But I think that you have made your base from right? Obviously, I mean, IPCC, the content which I got over here was very, like, it built my base actually. I think without my strong base, you cannot go into final C. Correct, correct. If you have a strong base, I think final C is very easy. <laughs> correct. Compared to if you have a weak base. Correct. So most of the things in uh, final CA, at least if you have a good base, so they become very easy, right? Yes, like costing, SF, FM, like it all continues. You just can't skip an IPCC because correct. final CA is linked to your IPCC. Correct, correct, correct. Tags, ID, everything. Okay. Correct. So now you're going to be giving all the interviews. So what is your plan from now onwards for your career? For now onwards, I'm thinking like there are many opportunities outside. Okay. Especially like there's this thing called management training where they train you for one year or two year in okay. all different areas. Okay. And then based on where you perform well, they place you there. Okay. So I think I'm planning to apply for some management training position. Yes. Okay. And how has your office been of your performance? How has your office reacted to oh, my all the like, Office is like great. I mean, my all my seniors. Yesterday only I met my client. Yeah. Everyone was so happy at my client place as well. Like even my office. Like I work for Deloitte. Okay. So yesterday itself, like Deloitte had gone to my college. So yeah. they invited me to uh, give a speech to all my fellow mates, and it was just great. I mean. Something you can't explain, there's just things. So life has been good, right? Since life has been great. <laughs> okay, so planning to do any further studies now? Uh, not really, I want to work for one year, two year. Then maybe I may give MBA, try for IIM. Okay. But MBA is a good, if you're a CA, then doing CAT makes actually a lot of sense. Uh, it is a division overall picture. Like, yeah. CA is very intense course and like, Focus few subjects, MBA is broad. It's broad, yeah. It's and broad. it improves your personality. Yes. And MBA is easier, they prefer chartered accountants. Yes, especially the IIS, like there are many yeah. engineers yeah. right now, so they prefer yeah. its diversity among their students. Yes. So, you will speak of, say, uh, final CA. Final CA, you were there with us for two years, I guess. Your portions have started around two years ago, right? Yes, April 16, I guess. 16 yeah, and we gave you around 9 months of leave to self study, right? Yes. And we got over like what, first week of January. First week of January. So, 9 months you got to study. That's a good time, right? That's a great time, like if you utilize it properly, it's great. Okay. So you have to, like, a lot of time to study, like, improve on your weak areas right. before you actually start studying for the final year. So, how were your uh, schedules given in final year? In final year, um, I think first, before April only we got a timetable for the entire year. For the entire, till the end, yeah. Okay. So, like, I think it started with costing and SFM, okay. and it was like all planned. Like, it, it, they had given uh, days for each and every subject, and it was continuous. So, you know, you were in connect with the subject, like, okay. you know. And then it got over as planned okay. throughout the entire year. Entire year. It's good way of doing the things, right? Like yes, if you, have you, you, you can plan as well, like, yeah. you know how to study and all, so that's right. good. Now we have one other feature in any case, in case you miss a lecture, then like, you know, you have an option of attending. Oh, that's nice, like, like, I used to miss a lot of lectures, like, during, since I was in Holland, I had many out session ones, I remember I missed half of your marginal constant. Uh, so, yes, that's great. So now, 
if a student misses up to 10 lectures, we allow them like you know to cover up that lecture with some new lectures. So those are the new things that we have started, I guess, since the time you have left us. So otherwise, uh, your eight papers, your overall total was how much? Five zero seven. Okay, 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 that's good. Now, I suppose few subjects I'll ask say, uh, FR you got how much? FR I got 57. That was the first paper, right? Yes, actually the thing was is it was the first paper and I got a rank in IPCC. Mm -hmm. So it was like, you know, this is the last time I have to prove myself and I have to get a rank. I had this in the back of my mind. So, I think there's this pressure to perform which made me nervous and that nervousness there are a few easy adjustments which I couldn't do. Okay. So I think I would like to tell everyone like please don't get nervous. I mean it's just the, the first paper. Yes, I mean everyone is nervous. So if you are confident, the half of the battle is already won. So okay. we calm. Like in, for all the rest of the people are very calm. Like. So if FR was good, your lines would have been far better. Yes. <laughs> tell about that's ah, that's okay. And SFM you scored? 85. That's very really good. SFM was a very great paper. Very well. The content also that we all did over here was good. Yes. Everything. Like derivatives and forex are like so it was made so easy mm -hmm. that people usually suffer that. Derivatives and forex, they don't understand. Malkan sir recovered all these things very well. Yes, yes, yes. Derivatives and forex are like especially like, all the sub chapters, but derivatives and forex I would like personally like to like you know recommend those chapters. Very good. And law audit. Law, uh, I did uh, reading man's notes. Mm. There used to be mnemonics, few phrases. Like, there's so many things to remember in law. If yes. you see, like, Correct. I know it's law and it's logic also, but the thing is, the portion is so much. Sometimes you have to remember. Correct. 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 So, a reading man, she understood that she used to make mnemonics. Okay. A few phrases. So, I used to use that to help myself to remember stuff because I'm not that great in other languages. Okay. So that was good. And I guess Sachin sir, your favorite sir from IPCC. <laughs> Sachin sir made audit so interesting that and he's king of audit, right? And giving all practical yes. examples. I think that's why I joined audit. Like uh, my application was done in audit. Okay. So he had made audit so interesting, and like once you into audit, you realize that audit is quite different from the theory. But Sachin sir never taught like this. He always taught us practically. He used to link things practically. Correct. And how you like all the essays and students practically so okay. you could understand. That's correct. Okay. Then coming to group two, we'll only have now two or three subjects now in each chart. Then we have some other kind of conversation. So how was costing with you? Costing was great. I mean I remember like the concept was so strong and I was confident that I would be able to solve the sum if I'm calm in the paper. Okay. That's one thing you should always remember during costing paper, have a good sleep and stay calm. And rest, let and you don't study time. much, right, for costing? No, no, I for the like over over my five months of studying, I must have given only ten to twelve days for costing, like oh, yeah, including first year, second division, third division, and even one division, two division, only ten to twelve days. But why is that? Most of the questions you remembered? Yeah, actually, the thing was you used to give us time to solve those sums, like yeah. so I used to always make that effort, you know, do it solve it in the, the, the class, so. Because of that, I should remember things. Like I should remember the sums, and I feel in costing. If you practice a lot, that's great. But it depends on student to student. Actually, I was a kind of a student. Like if my concepts are good, I think I can apply. I don't need to solve much sums. Like I would be wasting my time if I solve much sums. I could utilize the same time in some other subject. Mm. It depends on student to student. Actually, mm. you have to understand your own strengths. Mm. And then you have to work out your plan how to study. Okay. And say DT? DT. DT I scored 63. I, even in DT, like I remember international taxation this time they asked like you know something way out of the box or something. So I got scared a bit, but um, somewhere in the mind since I covered such a great content as such. So there was there in the back of my mind and like you know whatever I like it was like I think sometimes when your mind doesn't work, your subconscious mind works. Right. So even if you, you think, try to remember a few things yeah. that you think that you don't remember. Yeah, you remember that. It happened with me in IPCC also. So Arisa was very good. Arisa was great. <laughs> and he had full-fledged notes plus summary notes. Yes, yes. I mean many people like 
uh, either they have good summary but the content of the summary is not great or they have good content but there is no summary RS had both mm. so that was good okay. so everything was good yeah, everything was good so now all is past so how did you enjoy your success you had parties you went out for friends not going for vacations uh, actually these days I'm just a little busy like it's just one week and it's past like uh, there are a few calls like people asking me how to study and stuff like okay. there are some people in my profile and they start calling me okay. how to study and then I think there are like few things uh, related to my office like the seminars in my office like what's ahead okay. uh, like so right now I'm busy okay. let's see parking like <laughs> next week I'll start Okay. So, what do you like to advise to all these guys who are preparing for CA final, say with us or with anywhere? Uh, first, their I'll strategy th- or like you know how did you study? I think first thing I like to tell you all like one strategy cannot be used for each and every student. Like each and every student is different. First, identify your strengths and your weaknesses. So you know based on that you have to make your plan. I will tell three things which my friend used to always tell me. He was there throughout my journey. So one is be focused. Like I have seen a lot of people, they stay focused for one or two months, then they is like you know they are tired and then they lose out. Stay focused. Be consistent. You know, it is a test match. Like Krishna I told in the last interview. I you and Krishna friends. Yeah, like Achha, okay. we, we met in classes. Okay. So. So CPD is like T20, IPC is OD and this is test match. You have to be consistent. You cannot like study one day for 20 hours and the next day you sleep. No. Study 10 10 hours, that's enough. Be consistent throughout your 5 months. Don't waste much time because in the end everything piles up. So not to waste time. There should be good planning. Yeah, planning, planning. Planning is great. I mean, I remember before I started studying, the first thing which I did is finalizing where from where I'm going to study. Right. Like I remember I could like I missed a lot of classes because of my outstation audit or so and since my books were not complete, like then I had to refer some author books or something. Right. And sometimes you need reference books as well. Right. Don't study the everything from there, but you just, just refer a few there, things yeah. here and there. So finalize that first. Mm-hmm. Because if you change your books in between, then you know it's like a new start from right. scratch and then you are behind. Correct. Never ask your friends you know, how much you have you covered the portion and stuff. Right. I mean, makes either you sense. will get scared or he will get scared. Yeah. <laughs> There's no point asking. Yeah. So that is one thing. Stick to your plan. I mean, make a plan. Make sure you have enough time for everything. You will have revision time. If possible, please include a test series or something in your plan. Correct. I mean, writing practice is very important. I know like for FR causing SFM, like usually what I do is I just go through the some video of okay, okay, huh, these adjustments are there, let's do it. But you don't write it down. Correct. So sometimes what I mean like if the exam is your first test or something, Correct. You, you may not know from where to start the answer. Correct. So it's always good to have a test series. Mm-hmm. People may think you know, yeah, hua, or what if I fail, I'll get demoralized. So I like to tell you one thing, I'll give you a test series. I flunked in five seconds of the day. Okay. But that did not demoralize me. Not give up. Yeah, it's it just like it it's motivated me. It's, it's like, an eye opener also. Yeah, it, it's eye opener plus it motivated me. No, now I have to get this class to pull myself. Very. So just take it in a positive way. Concepts are important. Understanding of the concepts. So I mean if you're good with your concepts, it will cut down a lot of your time, you know, like going through the stuff. Okay. So that much time you save and you can use it as like you can have writing practice. Mm. Like I also made sure like you know in each of the practical subjects, like I told like, I never used to solve sums, but at least from each I also solve two sums. At least I have to some kind of good confidence. Yes. In your last three months you used to be studying a lot. Yes, in the last three months, yeah. Last time I was revision time. angry also on your parents, on everybody. No, not really. Not really. It's not frustrating time, right? I think the most tiring part for me was like 
one week before the exam, like I told my test results had come and then I realized I flunked at five something. That time I, it was a really eye opener and I used to study like more than 12 hours a day. Before I used to never study like I just try studying for 10 hours uh, initially for one two months and then I increased it to more 12 hours. That's it. Okay. Well, that much is enough. That much is and effective, you study, study, effective right? study. Like this. frankly, you cannot study 16 hours, 17 yes. hours, you even if not that. possible. Yes. The efficiency reduces all. I also like to tell you one thing, like time and health. Like health is very important. Like I remember during my exams, final exams, I was not well. Okay. So you know half your confidence goes there. Goes down, okay. And you don't feel like actually writing. If you're not very well, you don't huh. feel like writing much. So I think just make sure health is proper. I mean exams like after six months also exam will be there. Correct. But health is very important. Yes. I know one of my friends. His health was so down in 104 fever, drawing one of the paper. So, you know, make sure health is good. That's the first thing. This kind of thing. The same thing. I mean, I was in my exams, that was actually way back in 2004. So, every day we used to be going out, okay, we used to be playing cricket for one hour. You know, that was something that was part of my way or routine only. But that takes off many things also of you. So, like, you know, makes you much more fresher actually to do a next round of study. I used to watch videos, so funny videos or something. Like that. Okay. That would make me like laugh. Like, I, like usually people have this tendency, you know, they go for movies and stuff. I avoided that because you know, sometimes there's some movies that are so interesting. Even after the movie, I used to think about it. Correct. I think that takes away your time. So, yeah. So that's why I have to avoid such things. So finally, we have meat. Okay, if Meath can be doing it, only thing that will require is good hard work, good studies, okay, proper planning, good concepts. Also, one more thing I would like to add, sorry. It's like, uh, don't leave anything. I mean, this is CA final. Uh, I, if you just look at the trend, there have been times like they have been completely random. Like, there was this one attempt where they are 40 marks for X. I think in last attempt, May attempt, they are 40 marks valuation in FR. Correct. You really can't predict, like don't try to analyze. But there is one mistake that I think most of people do, they try to use the scanners to try to find out what is more important, what is not important. That is a true. simple way to avoid that is to do everything. Do everything, be good at everything. Yeah. And then let the ISA ask anything, you'll be right. prepared for everything. Now that is actually, you know, I'll rather say like, you know, that some people who, who have who guide the students, they are only marks oriented. So they try to tell those particular people like, you know, that this is important, this is not, and this is important, this is not. So ultimately it settled down to the mind, but ultimately these are still your professional exams. I remember there was this one subject, I don't know name. So someone asked me before that subject, during my final exam, please give me importance. Mm -hmm. so I have some importance and then I, like you know WhatsApp forwards you always get them. Mm -hmm. So I forwarded it to that person. So after the exam that was uh, the paper was very bad. Mm -hmm. What were your thoughts? was very great. Mm -hmm. But why nothing came from the importance? Oh, mm -hmm. I never did some importance. I did everything. You wanted importance, I gave it. Correct. So, but there is always a difference, like you know, between a good student and a person who only just wants to be passing, huh. and they're always looking for every shortcut in this world to try to, like you know, avoid the mass amount of study. Yeah, like I mean, like someone always used to tell me, like like a mentor to me, that people who study for four hundred marks, you should never study for just four hundred marks, because then you have this, you know, you could either be this side or that side. Correct. Always aim for higher marks and like, you know, only then it's like, you know, and study that way. Like, that's not just aim, but study. You cannot aim for passing actually. Yeah. You know, you should have some better aims. In there. Better aims. In there. So, I mean, thank you for joining us today. Okay, and all the best for the future. Okay, you, and uh, all your teachers are very proud of you. God bless you. Thank you, okay. sir. Thank you.